This segment is sponsored by the DC Office of Cable, Television, Film, Music, and Entertainment. DC creatives consist of the artists, musicians, chefs, writers, performers, and more. They are the engine that drive this, drives the city's identity as the cultural capital of the world. That's why the DC Office of Cable, Television, Film, and Music, and Entertainment sets aside September as 202 Creates Month to celebrate the creative community, culminating in this week's 38th Annual Mayor's Arts Award. Awards. I'm joined by director Latoya Foster, who will explain why this year's event will be a tribute to the DC creative community like none other. Welcome. Thank you Good so much morning. for being How here. How are you? Thank you all for oh, having yes. us and for continuing to be a great partner with us. We certainly appreciate you of so course, much. Of course, absolutely. We listen, we're so proud of everything that's going on in DC and you guys are doing so much. I know it's been a very busy month for 202 Creates. Indeed, but you know what Mayor Bowser likes it busy. This is a great time. It's a busy time. You know, two 202 Creates is a month that Mayor Bowser set aside every September to ensure that the creative community had a platform to express itself, that it had an opportunity to connect to a number of resources that were celebrating our creative community across all eight wards. And on this Thursday, we're going to be celebrating that creative community. Mayor Bowser will host the 38th Annual Mayor's Arts Awards. Now, I'll tell you, yeah. you know, our late great Marion Barry, the mayor for life, he once said a city without art is a city without soul and we need our soul and Mayor Bowser Absolutely. has not only made sure that this city keeps its soul but that it's amplified on a remarkable level which is why on Thursday we'll all be at the Lincoln Theater celebrating the diverse talent right here in our hometown we know that the 202 is creative that's yes, why we, we call this 202 <laughs> creates that's right that's right. Absolutely. Yeah, and 38 years. 38 Latoya, years. Latoya, how has it changed through the years? Oh, my goodness. You know, here's the thing. Talent evolves. Arts evolves. Mm -hmm. So you're going to see on Thursday a dynamic representation of evolution of arts in our city. You will witness everything from old Broadway to hip hop because it is the 50th anniversary of hip hop. You know, DC is go go and go go is DC. Yes, so you got to have is. some go go in of there. Course. But you'll feel jazz. You'll mm. feel opera. You'll see dance. You'll see everything that encompasses arts here in our nation's capital. We are the 202 creates. We are the, the district of creativity of culture and of cool and Mayor Bowser wants <laughs> to make that sure that's cool. right that's right Mayor Bowser wants to make sure that people all across our country know that our city is an entertainment mecca that we are talented we are not just politics we are creative as well so on Thursday I encourage everyone to come out and witness it for yourself and to RSVP at dcmayorsartsawards.com so you too can experience the diverse creativity creativity our great city has to offer that is wonderful I hope a lot of people come out and witness this. Oh, Tell absolutely. us a little bit about the theme, being bold. Being born, born, born being, bold. Yeah, oh, now, I like that. Being Mayor okay. Bowser knows it. We know it, that we are all born bold. Mm. God places boldness in all of us. But here's the thing. Oftentimes in life and in society, we are encouraged to dim our lights. We're placed in boxes. But Mayor Bowser says, not anymore. You were born bold, and we want you to express your bold creativity. You don't have to dim your light in this city. Mm -hmm. We want you to let your light shine in this city. And that is why Mayor Bowser is pushing the born bold theme because she recognizes that we are all born with boldness inside of us and she wants us to express it and let it all out. Wow. Well, we are so thankful to her and to you for Thank all you. that you guys do. Thank you so uh, much. Because you're bringing this to the forefront. Absolutely. It's easy to forget what's going on in D.C. with the politics. It's Absolutely. just easy yes. to get caught of up course. in that. But of no, course. like you said, we have so much culture. Absolutely. Absolutely. Here, and you guys are bringing that to the forefront. What are you most excited to see? You know what I think it is too? It's that you can make it here in this city. Mm -hmm. You don't have to leave this city to make it. This city's creativity drives our economy. You don't have to leave this city to be big, yeah. to be bold, to be creative. You can do it all right here. I'm excited to see it all. You oh, know, yeah. uh, my parents were very much into the arts. I love the arts. So, you know, there's not just one thing I'm honing in on, but I will say you will see some surprises there and you will witness some great talent right here out of our hometown. Wonderful. So for anyone who's watching that's 
thinking, this sounds great. How yep. can I get involved, learn more? How can I come and attend? Once again, how can they do that? They should RSVP at DCMayorsArtsAwards.com. Also, look into our office, the Office of Cable Television, Film, Music, and Entertainment. I'll tell you, we have a saying right now. We are blessed, booked, and busy. We are doing uh -huh. so many things. We want everyone to follow us on social media mm -hmm. at entertain DC underscore DC and at 202 Creates and DC Radio. We just had our sixth anniversary there. So we're doing a lot of dynamic things on behalf of Mayor Bowser, and we want everyone across all eight wards to be a part of this creative time in our city. That is wonderful. Thank you for all you do. Thank, Thank you. Thank you for Thank being you all here. so much. Thank you. And, and of course, we have Channel 9 Talent. That's right. Wisdom and Simone. That's right. Well, we can't wait for that big event. Thank you again for sharing Thank that with you. our viewers. Yes. Tickets are still available. The 38th Annual Mayor's Arts Awards is happening Thursday at the historic Lincoln Theater on U Street Northwest. It's starting at 6 p.m. It is free and open to the public. Just go to DCMayorsArtsAwards.com to RSVP and to get more information.